Hi everyone, this is Alan Culpepper with the Religious State of the 918 Project. And today we are in downtown Tulsa at Trinity Episcopal Church. The church has its origins back around 1903 when a small group of Episcopal families started gathering here in town. Um, in 1904, a priest from a church in Veneta began coming here to meet with them and in 1906 they built a much smaller church, a brick church I believe, uh, here on the corner of 5th and Cincinnati and let's see, by about 1920 I think they had outgrown that building and so they began work on the present building here and during the time that it was under construction, I believe they met at the old Majestic Theater downtown. The current building, which as you can see is a fine example of Gothic architecture, was, I believe, ready for opening in 1926, or thereabouts. Um, the upper level of stained glass windows, I believe, were added later on, I want to say in the 1960s, I'm not 100% sure of that, but I think it's approximately right. Um, and then there were some renovations to the church done as recently as 1991. Today it is a large downtown church with um, multiple Sunday services and that sort of thing. Um, it is a congregation which uh, identifies itself as a welcoming and affirming parish of the Episcopal Church. I'm going to take a walk around now and let you look at some of the architectural details of the church. Uh, The red doors are very typical of churches in the Anglican tradition. The inscription is a little bit difficult to read, but it says, Mine house shall be called a house of prayer for all people. Over here you will see the Trinity Parish House, which is the educational and social wing, I guess you would say, uh, of the church. I don't know exactly when it dates from. I believe it's a bit newer than the original church. And around back there are some newer additions as well. And that is Trinity Episcopal Church, downtown Tulsa.